Katie Price has had several strings of romances in the public eye, having even been tied to business mogul Simon Cowell. The pair were first introduced when Katie, 43, was just a teenager hoping to make her way into the music industry. The initial meeting led to a complicated relationship and developed into a friendship lasting more than 20 years. After Katie recalled allegedly spending the night in his bed several years ago, the pair have shown their attraction on screen. On screen, Simon, 62, has even admitted that he was eager to have a threesome involving the Mama Five and a Britain's Got Talent contestant. Get all the latest news sent to your inbox. Sign up for the free Mirror Newsletter. Way back in 2013, Simon was originally impressed by impersonator Francine on the latest episode of BGT, where she was notoriously known for impersonating former glamour model Katie. Speaking on the after show, Britain's Got More Talent, Simon made the saucy confession that he'd love to have a threesome with both Francine and Katie. Katie rang into the BGT spin-off to chat to Simon ahead of the show, having watched Francine get through to the final. Speaking live on the show, Katie revealed she had watched Francine mimic her, and admitted that she approved. She said, I think it is amazing Francine has gone through, I am a big fan of hers, she is so good at her impressions. Simon replied, I know you very well Katie, I wish I knew you better. And when he was asked which out of Francine and Katie he would like to date he smugly added, it'd have a threesome, I would. A surprised Katie turned to the impersonator and asked, are you up for that Francine? And Simon quipped back, well two of us are anyway. Several years later, in 2019, the blonde recalled the night she spent in bed with Simon and admitted that she loved his chest hair. She confessed that she had spent the night at his London pad after she and the X Factor mogul met at an awards party several years ago. Katie said that it was the first time she'd ever been in bed with a proper man. We kissed and I ran my fingers through his chest hair, she recalled. We were both at the Comedy Awards and I was single at the time. I'd had a lot to drink and he invited me back to his place. The reality star said she stayed the night and gentlemanly Cal sorted her a cab home in the morning, stating they had fun but did not have sex. Katie has had a string of romances in her time, having recently rekindled her romances with former Love Island star and fiancé Carl Woods. Several years after recalling a night with Simon, a letter was published last month by The Sun, which was written by former BGT judge and journalist Piers Morgan. He recalled the time when Katie allegedly tried having sex with him and was furious when Simon turned down her offer of a risque sex act on a string of wild nights out. Despite Katie's confession, Piers had stated that he and former pal Simon has both said no to sex. Piers' open letter was published, that was written for his ex-pal, urging her to seek help for her embarrassing train wreck of a life. Piers had wrote, I remember you stumbling towards me at Simon Cowell's 50th birthday party, where you'd morphed into full-on Jordan as the night wore on, and expressing your indignant rage that a birthday boy had just declined your offer of a risque sexual gift. I remember bumping into you at the National TV Awards and asking if you were intoxicated. I'm not drunk yet, you laughed, but I will be soon and when I am, watch out Morgan. Then you explained exactly what you would do to me, which I'm afraid is not repeatable in a family newspaper. He adds that Katie used to be his favorite celebrity due to her honesty and candid nature, but says he is now very concerned for her. Signing off, 
he wrote, but right now, I'm finding it very hard to praise you for anything because everything you do and say these days smacks of someone who has jumped the shark from amusing entertainer to embarrassing train wreck.